Okay, and he fumbled on his Overwatch. So then we're gonna we're gonna ground target here. Okay, now my other cat is yelling. What's going on? My house is so loud. Hello everyone, my name is Gracie and welcome to episode 24 of this Let's Play of Asia Wonders Planetfall on Thyona with Tarvox Skybound, our holy punch boy here. Well, he's using a sword right now, but you know what I mean. So, I do not remember what I'm working on, even though I just did it. Uh, what, oh, we want modular extension here. Right, 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 right. We're colonizing. I think we're sprinting to victory here, but it's going to take a long time to queue that up. We're healing up here so we can fight this. Let's just put all you people on pause. Yes, 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 yes. When you reload the game, you have to redo all of that for some reason. Okay, and turn. All right, we completed Back to Life, Back to Reality for the Spacers, which gives us some influence, some rep, and the Edge weapon, which is a tier four ethereal weapon. Bypass all shield and armor, because it's psionic and melee. Broken mind and life drain heals. Oh, in interesting. Now that is a Tarvox Skybound weapon, I believe, because he's using Swelter Blade, which is pretty good. It does more damage. No, it doesn't. It's because he doesn't have... Yeah, let's see what this does. This does 21 repeating psionic damage, and that, other than machines, really nobody's going to resist this. So it's going to do, like, true damage. It's going to do 21 damage or more, depending on events. That's pretty dang strong. And we can also... Oh my god, that's really fun. He's going to do so much damage to things that they're not going to have a chance to get, like, negative effects on them, which is pretty great. Because um, I was thinking, like, what if we put on the the Chimera mod just for the hell of it? Because this also increases damage, so we'd lose Cripple, but now we can do... Now we can do... Incendiary, High Impact Stagger, Poison, Bypass Shield, Bypass Armor, Broken Mind, Electrified, Enlightened, Life Drain, um, Celestial Judgment. Damn, that's going to hit hard. That's super cool. Burning, Electrified, and Poison. Jeez. So he hits something with this sword and they just <laughs> their life is just ruined. <laughs> uh, oh, they spit out a new unit. Oh, you little... I don't want to fight an extra stack of these. They're tough enough as it is. Yeah, look, it's 19, so much stronger than me. Okay, let's just wait. Oh my god. Of course, that always happens. Production, Oops. development, advanced military engineering. So I'm talking like a mile a minute. I think I had my coffee too quickly. The worst. So we're waiting on more population, but we're never going to get there. I think I'll just do it at, at, um, at 20 and not worry about a second whatever district. It's not going to matter. There's an unopened se sector right here. Interesting. Confirm movement for my small children. Yeah, go here. Why are you modded? Oh, you came with the mods that were on the unit I ate. Weird. What are you guys all working on? I don't remember what we're working on down here. Oh, there's a site here to go into. Can't quite reach. And then you... Looks like there's no... Oops, nothing to clear out up here anymore. There's a spacer cosmite thing down there. I might send... Um, are you guys amphibious? No. Uh, here, you're floating. You go down there and talk to them. Can I have this? Thank you. And then we'll re-link we'll re up. Shouldn't be too too long to do that. Uh, this is a new city. Exciting new city. Replicator factory. All the usual things. And then do I have any other cities that can share food? Actually, no. I mean, just, the cities on this planet are kind of small. Except for this one, because they had they were smart and used food right off the bat, and I settled in this terrible spot up here. The city is absurdly large for how crappy it is. I think there's just a lot of these like bonus buildings that help me out. Like, this is a lot here. We're getting plus twenty food, 
plus 20 food, plus 5 food. This sector is providing an absurd amount of food. We're getting artificially fertilized, plus 15. And then we're getting... What is this artificially fertile? Is that from an event? Oh yeah, there was a terraforming event. Okay, so this sector is providing 15 food. 20, so that's 35, 55, 75, 80 food. This sector provides 80 food in, a, in what used to be a volcanic area. That's fantastic. Yeah, we're gonna have to start sharing that food. Um, might go ahead put that on share half now oh no um yeah it doesn't matter it doesn't matter let me share that food are you still taking all of the food out of the pool yep the city is taking every piece of food being donated wild okay and turn okay we are able to take on this little spawner here um we're barely stronger with because uh, <laughs> the chalices are so. Oh, that's a brood mother or clutch mother. Uh, Elder Octoway. Oh my god. I I do not remember Elder Octowales being in this game. That is so weird to me. Oh dear. Okay. Well, let's see what we can do here. I, I've not. I don't remember ever fighting an Elder Octowale. I don't know if that's just like a really late game naval thing, and I just don't play with the naval stuff late game. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, they're all gooey. God, it's huge. It is huge. I cannot believe I have a tier four aquatic unit. That is wild. Okay. Okay. What does it do again? Where is it? Whale. Okay. You have. Oh my God. It takes up two and a half hexes. <laughs> Look how big this thing is. What a unit. Oh, I should have given her. Um, oh, free willy. I did. I did name him. Okay. Uh, so this one's a boy, and we've got uh, sinks to its allies, granting melee attacks a chance to disable. Um, uh, in addition, their range attacks have increased crit chance. Cancels Song of Swiftness. So we're currently in Song of Swiftness, which does what? Uh, fast movement speed and is fifteen percent harder to hit. Oh, okay. So we use that to close in, and then once we're in, we switch to Song of Aggression and try to disable them all. We also have Submerge. We have an Ink Cloud. Oh, there's a round this unit. I don't want to click that. Gunk Shot. Pretty high damage. So this is really a, a very powerful support unit. 90 health and 6 armor. Gosh. Oh, you are cool, Free Willy. I like you a lot. God, look at the size of this unit. Uh, I think I should probably submerge. Okay. Um, so we have lots of sharpshooters. So maybe we just like... Kind of take it slow. I don't think they're going to get close enough for that. And another one back here. So let's send Tarbok in. Transfer pain. Send you over like here. I might even go to here. Just trying to split up a little bit for AoEs. Make it a little harder. Okay. Uh, a little worried about this first turn. I could... Oh, I could get poison off. Poison is pretty useful because it makes them unhappy. Uh, never mind, they have the mutation. Uh, but at least we did poison that one and that one. Excellent. Okay, well, that's fine. That's fine. I guess we might as well do that. Okay, here we go. First turn's the scariest with the hyperaggression. Yep, yep. Song of Swiftness. Shouldn't that have already have been active? Maybe the Marauders don't get that automatically. Oh. Just undid all my hard work. Operations ready. 
The grace was 17 damage. Dear God. So I can make my melee attacks have a chance to disable. Am I gonna be melee? Yeah, I'm gonna be meleeing a little bit. Okay, so let's um. But if I if I switch that, okay, so what I gotta do is get everybody into position, then change the song. Because otherwise we don't have the movement to get there, I think. So then now we switch to Song of Aggression. And range attacks have a crit chance. Okay, cool. And we get a full action continue so we can still move. Um, we, go, we put regeneration on this guy, so I think we can just go in. So now we have a chance to disable. It's a very low chance. Why does this one not have a overwatch here? Oh, this one is immune to uh, ignore overwatch. Cool. Okay. Does, do we have that on Tarvok? I don't think so. Yeah. So there is an overwatch if I miss on this one. Okay. So let's use this one first. Okay. Crippled. But no, no overwatch. Now this one... This one hits so hard. It is absurd how hard this hits. But I'll get Overwatch, but he's pretty damn tanky. Let's go ahead and do it and see what fresh hell we can unleash on this thing. Oh my god, we got a crit. Oh. Oh my god. So it staggered it from the crit. So he didn't get Overwatch. So we ended up Broken Mind and Electrifying. The Broken Mind doesn't matter because they're immune to negative morale. But still, nice to have that crit. It's a free, free critical. Oh my god. As a graze. Now, incendiary chance. Oh, it takes seven days. So this one's immune to burning? Cannot be flanked. Unit is immune to burning and immolation. Right, because it can submerge. Okay. That makes sense. We're in the water. Um, and then you. These are really bad. I'll just float you on. Now, you don't have much armor or shielding, actually, even though you've got good health. So we're just going to put you here for the swarm shield, maybe. I'm going to put you in defense, I think. Pooping out eggs. Uh, biologists in the in the comments, let me know if that's how that works. So we've got we've got to kill. Now this thing is full health. How? Hmm. Okay, so we um you got to come over here, slash this thing. Disabled. Awesome. Okay. Light it up. What do we have here? We have the burning. So we don't we don't want the burning. So let's just shoot this one right next to us. Uh, this one also has burning. Right, right. Crit. Awesome. It's only 15. Oh, yeah. This is <laughs> 8 armor. Oh, my God. So we want to go in and try to disable this one, I think. It's not likely. Okay, we're getting our frenzy up, though. Now, you have a stinky cloud. So we could go in here. This will debilitating infection blind, hopefully, slow, hopefully. Okay, we didn't get... Okay, but why didn't I get overwatched? Oh, there we go. Concussion resisted. Jesus. I forgot that it has concussion on this crash. Good lord. These things are so powerful. 
I am I am pogging out of my gourd, <laughs> as they say. <laughs> um, that would stagger. Broken mind. Let's stagger this one. I'm worried about the DPS output of these two combined. Back here is dead. Oh, a miss. Oof. Uh, people are exploding. That could possibly give concussion now. Fumble chance 20%. Oh, we're unhappy because we're blighted. Wild. Um. Goodness. Goodness gracious. I can't believe we're still trying to so like the <laughs> wild, absolutely wild. Okay, I wish I could get. I want to get to a position where I can cure this one and this one because he's blinded. But I need I need this one to be dead. So let's um. I want to get the armor off of the octo whale because it's taking so long to kill it. Down to seven. I need this thing out of here. Oh, 40%. Oh my god. Bad. Bad, bad, bad. 5%. I shouldn't have taken that. Don't miss. Oh god. How are you hitting? Okay. <laughs> um, so let's have you punch this one down. Enemy killed. And then you can go to here. Oh, I can't get both of them. Cleansing Pulse. It's a one hex radius. So you're, you're not gonna able to attack this turn anyway. So let's just do that. So we get the bladed removed. So now you can actually attack. A concussion chance here. There's a lot happening. Okay, I blade it again. That's fine. That's fine. Let's get you um, probably heal because I think we're about we're about out out of um, like I think the combat's gonna end. Enemy down. Oh, we still have to kill this unit. Interesting. Graze. You don't have a heal or anything, do you? No. Our forces are victorious. Whoa, elder octa whales make fights wild. That is so interesting. I got a regular octa whale and a reaper sniper. Do I want this cripple anti air? Um, yeah, it's fine. We're, we're forming a navy out of some weird units here. No, I don't want a forward base. Thank you. Thank you very much. Well, what am I doing with you guys now? Oh, uh, that was a quest I had over in this area, and then I stopped to do that thingy. Right, right, right. All right, let's move on this away. Proposal from Stanozoid, fine. Tormented. You might be able to hear my cat in the background yelling for some reason. Probably gotta go check on that. Hang on, I'll do it when I end turn. And where are we headed with this group? I guess we could go over to the water and try to take out spawners or something. You are gonna go inside this location. Psy Shrine. An elite barrager that's doing electrical, which we don't care about. Now this group has the apex. Now that's gonna be pretty good because they got a lot of melee so we can just slash the shit out of them because it's an AOE. You are in a ravenous. Yeah, yeah, we have a. This is actually quite strong. Let's. Do, I want to do this one manually though, because it looks pretty fun. Okay. 
we've got the Apex. Do we have... We don't really have buffs. Other than the... Uh, we've got the Squirrel Grenade, but the problem is, in order to use it, we have to get into a clump. And then we're going to take a bunch of damage. Um, and this has a chance to electrify, immobilize, slow... Yeah, so I don't think the Grenade is the best choice here. I think... What I could do is clump up as best as I could. Okay, hang on. I gotta go check on my cat. Okay, I'm back. She's, she's upset that her other parent went outside without her. Uh, so I think she just wanted to be outside. So, okay. So let me get... Let me get everybody, like... Let me get the, the close range people in a clump. And maybe, maybe this one. And then I'm gonna resistance grenade... And then we're going to try to separate back out a little bit. You can go in the front. You're pretty tanky. Um, could actually go like kind of far up. Because um, your hyper armor gives you even more armor. And can you even be staggered? No, you're stagger immune. So you're going to be in defense mode. So let's do that. We've got 12 armor and 2 shield. And then you'll go up to here. We'll send you guys around this way. We can get you into the resistance acorn. And then to here. Now I know we're still vulnerable to AoE, but at least it's not everybody at once. Um, yeah. I don't know what's happening, but I think I'm winning. Damn it. Oh, I didn't think they could go that far. I should have checked. I have to send the Apex around after those Lightbringers. All right, so we're gonna start off with a, with a Cleansing Pulse. There we go, I can see and breathe. Mm, got a pretty good grenade option back there. So let's get the apex onto these guys here. He yeah. Still get Yeah. And you guys got staggered, so flanking shot. Can we get a full shot? Yeah, but it's not that helpful. Well, there's a guy here, too. I got a 97% chance to eat this unit. Okay, so we don't have to worry about that unit now. So I could use this sniper here. And then snapshot it. Enemy down. And then I could grenade here. That's fun. That's a lot of value. Okay, and then we're going to go over here. We're going to frenzy on frenzy here. But they're crippled, and we're frenzied. So, they, they are weaker than us now. Yeah, they they only do 6 damage, 60%. But they can infect us, and also cripple us. But then they get shield of... They get remorsed, and then we do more damage. Okay. Regen. Uh. Oh, there's so much happening. Okay, they're going after the squirrel. That was a dumb idea. Hey, no, what happened to you? Oh my god, you, wait, no, what? You got panicked? What panicked you? Cripple, Psy infected claws. To, six strength chance to apply either concussion, insanity, panic, catatonic, or immobilize. Uh, bad. <laughs> Not good. 
All right, let's throw the grenade. Um, I actually could go up to here. Oh, you're immobilized. Oh my god. All right, we'll throw it here. Heal and dispel effects. But you're also staggered. God. You guys are being turds. Okay, let's run over to here. Send our, our assassin squad in. Yeah. Okay, and he fumbled on his Overwatch. So then we're gonna we're gonna ground target here. Okay, now my other cat is yelling. What's going on? My house is so loud. Uh, we can poop out some larva buddies. Ugh. Oh, you guys get to take a turn. Um, well, let's blind this one. Nice. Okay, so then you guys can snapshot that one. Enemy down. Oh, I sealed my devourer in here accidentally. So we'll just go over here. Fight this guy. Holy shit. <laughs> That's a lot of damage. Everybody explodes when they die. Stop it. Sniper up here. Can't hit that one. We'll go with this one. Debilitating infection. Stagger. And that does what? I always forget. 20% easier to hit. It has minus 400. Why does this infect? Oh, because it may they're like literally debilitated like physically. Like they can't move quickly. So it makes them easier to hit because they can't dodge. Interesting. And minus 400. So they have a 20% fumble chance. Uh, is anybody left? Nope. All of our regen popping off here. So we're at the end, so it's time to use up any extra healing we have before we win. Grenade this guy here. Our forces are victorious. Oh, that was a that was a fun one. I like when I get to just wade into battle with giant melee units that just can't die and just just mess everything up. It's really fun. We will take all of that. I like the science. We've got more babies, producing babies constantly. Um. And then I don't have anything for you guys to do. There's a Marauder Nest over there. That's something to do. Lava Masquat needs something to do. Food Sector. Upgrade. Vervoski. Yeah, this needs to be changed to Werewolfski. There we go. Werewolfski needs another sector. We've got this one for you here. That's a good one. Um... Ready. So this one is now sharing food even better. We've got a level 5. So we're getting minus 30% for population growth, minus 2 upkeep per person. So we're barely using any food on our own population, which means we're producing a ton of food, and then we're sharing it at a really good... Yeah, we make plus 3 food per colonist. So, oh my god, so each person in here is making 10 food. Holy crap, that's amazing. That is amazing. Wow. <laughs> Holy moly. Okay. So I think it's time to end this episode. Yeah, yeah, we're at time. So let's end this episode here. Um, I am having a great time with this, although I know I'm not fighting players very much. And I know that some of you have suggested that I make a very PvP oriented planet next, which I think I will do. I'll make the map small, pump up the players, and uh, just make sure that it's going to be player versus player. Uh, but I'm not going to stop going for planets with the relics because that's what I like working on is unlocking the new relics. So we'll, we'll see what we have. I'm sure we'll have something interesting to work towards. So thank you everybody so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying this series. If you are, like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next episode. Thanks again.